Good morning, everyone. So I woke up this morning pretty early to the sound of just multiple wolves just howling around, you know, just having a little little wolf, wolf pack howl. Howly, howly. Wake up, heaven. That's good. It's actually time for me to wake up. At five, the jet lag's got me. It's a good thing. I've been editing my new video, which you're seeing and seen already, and some photos. I'm, I'm very happy about uh, this trip so far. I think it's now time for me to go to the cafe and get some coffee. Get some coffee. I love the color of this place. The vibes just look so nice. I love it. Also, by the way, after finally successfully lighting a fire yesterday, I set off the smoke alarm because I put my socks to dry on top of the stove, and they burnt to a crisp. Darn. Oh, hello there, pretty boy. What are you up to today? Look how pretty your fur is. Oh my lord. Oh boy. I've just come back to my wolf cabin. Sadly, I don't get to stay here another night. I'd love to spend some more time with the beautiful wolves out there. But, by the way, I hope you don't mind. We've now switched. We're shooting 1080p, okay? We dropped the 4K. What's the point of the 4K camera? It, it's not as stable. I don't know if you noticed, but yesterday's vlog may be slightly shaky. Now it should be way, 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 way more stable. Even if I'm like, Today's game plan is to go explore Park Omega and see all the fauna and wildlife there. Do you have your seatbelt on, sir? So today I'm joined with Serge. Hello. Introduce yourself here. So I'm the technical director and spokesperson for Omega Park. I'm a zoologist. Cool. How long have you been doing zoology? Uh, 37 years. Okay. I'm, I'm not as old as that, but you know, one day I'll be able to say that. That's cool. We also, <laughs> by the way, just have some... What are these? Uh, these are elk. elk. Yeah. Elk. So. Oh, there they go. Yeah. All right. Now we are the first car into the reserve, the animal reserve, and then they're here. So now what you can do to attract this young boy. Here you go. Oh here my here. God! Hello. Oh. Uh, he want. This is when he wanted to say, "Oh, yeah, are you my friend?" Oh. There you go. Wow! What a beautiful boy. This is a privileged contact with fauna. That's Canadian. Let's go feed some deer. Oh, hello, mister. For you, my friend. Yummy. Hello, little girl. I've got one for you. One for you. So it's spotted family deer, black family deer, and white family. So the first stop on our trip in Omega Park is Trout Lake. Basically, this is a, a big lake with a trail that goes all the way around the edge. And at different spots around it are each of the 11 First Nations of Quebec, Canada. Like, each of them have a specific spot where uh, people from their nations actually built totem poles, uh, talked about their history and their culture, and looks like I have a friend with me today. Look how blue the sky is. It's just so blue. We put some food, and then you, you have wildlife who will come and eat there, and it gives an opportunity to our uh, clients to stop by and see wildlife. Oh, what do we have in the winter? Well, in the winter we'll have black squirrels, we'll have uh, uh, blue jays, uh, we have our wild turkeys that come, but in the summer you'll have all, there's all kinds of different species that live in this large park. Look at Uncle Serge here. Yeah, here you go. Wow. Majestuous. Fantastic. That is such a big guy. There uh, you go. You deserve this tree, my friend. Good. The antlers are fantastic. Look this at that a... guy's antlers. Um, His head you... must be so heavy. Oh, yeah. Allez! Viens! I can't believe Allez. these wolves speak French. Yes. <laughs> Allez, viens! Whoa. Yeah, look at that bye, You know what the buffalo dad said when his kid left for school? Bye, son. <laughs> this is just uh, oh like, wow! Look it, at that natural shelter. Yeah, this guy's it's all got. everything we built. I told you, it's all in link with nature. So instead of carpenters, we, we use artisan, artisan. So we've now made it to the wolf enclosure. Just like last night, we have little wolves just chilling here, all howling it up. Look oh my gosh! Father. You know, you just noticed they're babies. They are little babies. It's about the uh, oldest legend in French Canada. It's called the Chasse Galerie. So folk singers are singing about it and 
movies were done about this legend. It's really known, it's passed on from, from generation to generation to generation. It's about lumberjacks and you can see the canoe is flying to a village there. and makes a deal with the devil. And the deal is that, well, you gotta bring me to see my fiance tonight, I'm gonna lose her. So the devil says, okay, fine. Grab your man, go in the canoe there. I'll fly you to the village, but I'll warn you. You cannot swear and you cannot get drunk. And he does not succeed getting his fiance back. Rough. So he comes back to the canoe and had drank and swear. And uh, so if the canoe flies and halfway to the camp falls in the mountain, it's in the winter. Uh, they all survive, but they had to walk miles and miles to the camp. Moral of the story is that, well, if you make a deal with the devil, you will have no success. And that's a simple story that stayed for generation and generation, and it's called a chasse galerie. And this piece of art was done to represent that in this pioneer land uh, part of Canada here. Also, don't swear. Don't swear. <laughs> <laughs>
now made it to Mount Tremblant. Wow, this place is like a beautiful, cute little mountain village. There's like so many lights and there's so many little towns. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. You know, I've just only noticed just now that going over the hotel in which I'm staying at is a giant chairlift. Look at this. There, there, there's a chairlift that goes right across the entire town. That's crazy. Ah, welcome. Got a hotel. No wolves for this one, I'm afraid. Bit of a shame. Just looking through this place, it reminds me very much of Switzerland. It's a, like the whole like village is a very Swiss village. Maybe it's just because it's a mountain ski village. Who knows? Honestly, this place is so adorable. This little town reminds me of like something out of Disneyland because it shouldn't exist. That's how cute it is. We have real icicles, not fake ones here. It's like we're in Santa's village, except Santa's real. No offense, kids. Oh my gosh, I am so exhausted and dead and full and... What a crazy busy day. Oh my lord, what... A crazy, crazy day. Thank you, Quebec. This has been an amazing trip so far. Tomorrow, I'm going skiing. Mantra Blanc, all right? Thank you very much. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, you know what you can do. Also, uh, if you haven't, you can subscribe. I make new videos all the time whenever I'm traveling. See you tomorrow. Thank you so much. This is my previous one, by the way. It's all right. It's good. I'll see you then. Bye-bye.